So number 5, the diagram on the right shows a part of a circle with center O and radius of 10 cm. Tangent to the circle at point M and point N meet at P. So when it's saying about tangent, we know this one is 90 degree, this one is 90 degree. So meet at P and MON is 51 degree. Right, so calculate the length of MN in CN. So when saying about arc length, so we know arc length is equal to S, where the formula S is equal to R theta. So this one is the radius and this one is angle in radian. So we see here we have the radius already which is 10 CM. But we need to find out what is the radian. So we have 51 degree. So we know that degree, so degree to radian, uh, we have to multiply with so 180 should be below because degree is larger than radian so pi over 180 so here we have 51 so theta 51 so 51 time pi is 3.142 divided by 180 so here we get 0 0.8902 radian so we here we have the radian so we have Theta here 0 0.8902. So here we have 8.902 as the arc length is in cm. So 8.902 cm. So this is 8.902 cm. So B, the perimeter of the shaded region. So we see here the perimeter of the shaded region is RMN plus. So you have to need to know what is MP plus PN. So we know this is 90 degree. So we can divide the triangle into two. So this is 51. So half of 51 is 25.5 degree. So you can use trigo. This is so. Cha. Tuala. So you see here this one is 90 degree. So this is the theta. So we know that. 10 cm is beside just beside the degree so this is adjacent so we wanted to find here so mp is the uh, is the opposite or o so the formula which are using the adjacent and opposite so o and a is tangent so we know that tangent theta is equal to opposite over adjacent so theta is equal to 25.5 so, tangent 25.5 is equal to opposite. So, opposite is MP divided by adjacent is 10 cm. So, MP is equal to 10 times tangent 25.5 is equal to 4.770 cm. So, RMN is equal to 8.902 plus MP. So, MP is 4.770. So we know that Pn, so here Pn is equal to Mp. So we just multiply with 2. So here we get 18.44 cm.